Hello everybody, welcome back to Wolfie Extras. Today, the PB teams for, now let me remember, Pandora's Box 12, I think, have been announced either way. Um, th these are not the teams, this is just a, a screenshot from my team's incredible and totally fair performance during the last PB, where I did manage to actually clutch up a win. I don't think I was the one who did it. No, it was not me, I think. Anyways, <laughs> uh, let's begin with the teams, I guess. Uh, starting off with the Crimson Cyclopes, I should have probably done this, or should have probably looked into the images first, but whatever. Um, Crimson Cyclopes, Ghosty Fruit, CPK, Firebreathman, and MC Morgan plays. Mr. Callum, CPK, coming back from, um, retirement, I guess, in PB. He said he was gonna retire last time, but hey, he's, he's back to give it another, uh, go, I guess. Uh, Ghosty also back from, I think, subbing in last event, or maybe an event before. I think she subbed in uh, as, like, a newcomer last event. And I know Shane and Morgan have been wanting to duo in PB or just in any event for a long time. And PB is kind of the easiest event to pull that off. So here you go. Very cool team. It's going to be a very fun team. Um, everyone on this team should be familiar with each other. Like, Morgan knows... Uh, Morgan and Callum have used to play Valorant a little bit. Uh, back in the day, so hey, cool team. Next up, you got the Hazel Hydras, Locky Nest, Dong Fortnite, It's Eagles, Piggles, Remote, Birch 5. Now, I thought when this got revealed that this team was overpowered because I remember Mr. Sam Dong Fortnite getting first last time he played, but I forgot that he doesn't typically, typically do that. But maybe he will again, you never know. Maybe he is the goat at PB now, maybe he's just the best. Or maybe I'm wrong. I also thought Remote Birch was like a parkour legend, so I could be wrong. I, I don't know. And Lockie's also not bad at the game at all. You know, he's, he's pretty solid. Uh, Piggles is Piggles. I mean, he's, he's good. So this is a good team, too. Uh, I just thought it was OP when it first got revealed, but clearly I was wrong because some other people have said that it's not. So who knows? Anyways, moving on. Golden Griffins. You got SMK, Standin. Not Souls, Pixel Crafting. It's really awkward <laughs> saying people's usernames instead of their actual names. But uh, Nair, obviously being the lead player, Nair's one of the strongest Minecraft players in any event, really. Um, and SMK, I think, hasn't played much recently, I think. I could be wrong, but I, I, if I recall correctly, SMK hasn't played that much recently. Um, Jack's been in, like, every PB. Jack's been almost in more PBs than me, which is kind of crazy because I've only missed two, I think, or one. One or two? Two. How many? I don't know. Uh, and then Pixel is also nice to see back again. This will be a very fun team. This is kind of... I, I think this is team... Uh, no, never mind. Never. I was going to say team bats, but that's just SMK and Pixel, I think, right? Uh, yeah. And Jack was not on there. Jack wasn't even in Block Horse when team bats happened. Uh, anyways, moving on. Uh, Mint Mermaids, you got <laughs> Ogar, Purpled, Misty, and Anthos. Absolutely insane team, by the way. Um, I mean, PB is PB. It's actually fair or balanced statistically, at least in Pandora's box. Um, but it's crazy. It's, it's, it looks insane on paper. I mean, put this in block course. I don't think you could balance this. Even in Origins, there's no shots that this could be fair. Um, but yeah, Ogar, Purple Duo, they've been wanting to team in an event for a while. So it's good to see that they finally get the shot and uh, get a chance to do so. Uh, Purple Misty is also a duo that uh, I know has been talked about, whether that was internally or externally uh, for a while. So cool that they also get to team Ogar and Misty as well, a little cat duo. And Anthos also fits the team very nicely. Um, so cool team, all in all, I, I like it. Next up, the best team, the Diamond Dragons. You got me, Fruitberry, Antfrost, and Ted's Attic. Very nice team. I'm very happy with it. Um, you know, I duoed with Fruit for this event. That was my, like, fun, unexpected duo. Um, I didn't expect it. Fruit just asked. I was like, sure. <laughs> Ted also coming back after, uh, I don't even know how many events it's been. I think the last time Ted played was with me, and that was his first event. So this is his second time playing, um, <laughs> which probably means that he's going to have kind of a pretty significant newcomer diff because he probably hasn't seen anything from PB in a while, but very excited to see a team with Ted, and Ant's always fun to team with as well, so I'm very excited to, to play with my teammates uh, on, uh, when is it? April 7th. I was like, is it next week? But it's not next week. It's the week weekend after. 
Um, either way, very fun team, very excited. We're gonna be silly, goofy, and probably pretty good at PvP. Uh, looking at my team, as much as I'm not that great at PvP, uh, I mean, I'm not bad, but like, compared to some of the better ones in, in events, I'm not that great. But Ted's not, not bad at PvP, I think, either, so. And Fruit and Ant is like a crazy PvP duo, at least to me. So, hey, could be pretty good. Next up uh, is the team that a lot of people, uh, before the teams got announced, uh, said is OP, which, I, I don't know, it's pretty solid. I mean, it doesn't have a single bad player on it, and An uh, Aimston is a really good player, but compared to, like, other PB top frags, Aimston hasn't, like, done, like, super exceptionally well, you know, but still really good. Um, Force of it also joining uh, as a newcomer. I think the first newcomer that we've seen announced in this team set. There's two more to come. Um, and then, I mean, the thumbnail probably already revealed two of them. Uh, if I had to guess, it's probably going to be the thumbnail. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Force, uh, Forcey, Radoon's duo from Live Still, Red and Boost for duo is something I've wanted to see in an event for a while because they have pretty good chemistry. And um, I feel like it's odd that it hasn't happened, unless it has, and I forgot about it. But I, I feel like it should have happened a bit more often. I feel like, as much as me and Booster is a fun duo, I feel like Red and Booster would have made a bit more sense to happen like three times in a row. Um, but hey, you never know. Uh, and then Imson Red also, you know, they're, they're pals. So, cool combo. I like this team. Uh, I think it is very much uh, a potential winning team. I think this team is very likely to get top half. But um, you never know with PB at this point. Surprises happen. And yeah. I don't know. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes you just have a, a, a sick performance, and sometimes you have a little stinker. So, also, Forcey and Red just won Minecraft Mayhem. Sorry for the spoilers, but they just won Minecraft Mayhem together. So, they're they're uh, they've got some back-to-back -back energy, even though it's not the same event. Back-to-back -back win energy, very good for them. Next up, Purple Phoenixes. You got Chaos Twenty One A, Kaylin, Kyleff, and Yawn Champ. Almost four Ks. Um, hey. Close enough, I guess. Um, Chaos and Kalen, I think, is a duo that they've been wanting to try for a while. I could be wrong. But, yeah. Cool duo. Sorry for the yod. Very cool duo. I like it. Um, or, just, you know, it's, it's interesting duo. They're good friends. Uh, Kyle F. the GOAT, you know. He he was he was my, my right-hand man in uh, my last win. Us two joint in, in the leaderboard. Top, top tier. Bottom frags, I guess. <laughs> um, <laughs> and then Yon, I think, also hasn't played much. Uh, I think this might be Yon's second event or third. Um, so, yeah, also, you know, f some fresh faces in the, in the event. Always nice. So, yeah, cool. Purple Phoenix. Oh, my God. Cool, cool team. I, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm tired. Uh, <laughs> and then finally is a full HPG team. I don't know when the last time, uh, when when the last full HPG team happened uh, in, in a Minecraft event, aside from obviously like a speedrunning event. Um, I don't know when the last time was that you, you would have seen a full HPG team, but Pandora's box is making it possible. You know, this this is very much a fair team in PB. Um, at least that's what we think. So yeah. Cool team, Lewis Fulham, Feinberg, Curryway, and Poundy. Curry and Poundy being new to the event. Um, very exciting uh, to see them in. I think they'll they'll have a good time in PB. They're they're competitive players, so they'll they'll enjoy the competitive vibes. I think. Obviously, Fine and Curry is a is a very very reliable duo in events, and also one that you've seen probably quite a few times. Uh, I mean, it's happening in Block Wars. It's already happened in Block Wars before. It just happened in the Spanish tournament. Like, it's a classic, okay? Um, Lewis as well, always fun to see in events. And Poundy, very nice uh, person as well. Also fun to see in events. So yeah, that is the, the teams for PB12, I think. Yeah, PB12 on April 7th at 2.30 p.m. EST. Who are you planning to watch? Is it going to be me? I would expect that if you're a Wolfie Extras viewer. But then again... I, my, my, my videos get like a couple thousand views and you know, that doesn't translate over. So clearly we got some, uh, some frauds in the, in the audience. Okay. Who's, who's watching Redoons? Come on. I know that some of you watch Redoons. Come on, come over to the Wolfie channel. I did just win. Okay. Back to back energy. It's, it's an all time high. Okay. Right now. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Goodbye.